Hi, this is Sheila Renninger, and welcome to Ion Celebrity. Okay, so we got the latest word on Justin Bieber's crazy party, which racked up those three police phone calls the other night. And these stories have come from actual guests Floyd Mayweather and Chris Brown. Sources say there were at least 20 strippers present. And the Beebs was reportedly the top tipper of the evening, dropping at least $10,000 in singles. And one girl said she made $1,300 alone. They also stated there were three open bars and more than enough weed for everyone. So, sounds like there's some crazy stuff going on at the Bieber residence lately. Kanye West is none too happy about President Barack Obama calling him a jackass. And he wants everyone to know about it. So Kanye took to 107.9 recently in Philadelphia to express his anger saying, quote, I don't care if you're the president, I bring joy to people, end quote. Kanye added that Obama better not have anything to say about Kim either. So hopefully Obama will take the hint because who knows what Kanye is capable of. So Mr. President, consider yourself warned. Okay, so it looks like Alec Baldwin isn't the only one in trouble for writing a check his mouth just couldn't cash. Sylvester Stallone has recently been accused of a race field rant. A photographer is claiming that Stallone called him the N-word, but his wife says otherwise. Jennifer Flavin, who's known Sly for 25 years, says she's never even heard him utter the word, not even once, and she has a hard time believing he would ever say it. Flavin is insisting that the photographer either wants attention, money, or simply just misheard, but she insists that Sly would never say such a thing. And finally, news has arisen that Lindsay Lohan will be featured in an episode of HBO's Eastbound and Down, where she'll be making a cameo at a rehab center. Lindsay claims the footage was actually shot months ago, and her role will be a big part of the series finale. I don't think it's what most people are expecting, but be sure to check it out. That's it for today's news. See you next time.